Hi, I'm Emily Zilber, Curator of Contemporary Decorative Arts, and I'd like to introduce you to the exhibition, New Blue and White. Over the course of a millennium, blue and white has become one of the most recognized types of ceramic production worldwide. At its simplest terms, blue and white refers to cobalt pigment applied to white clay that takes many different forms, and all of the artists in the exhibition New Blue and White have looked to various blue and white traditions in making their contemporary statements. Blue and white is such a touchstone for so many people because many of us grew up with blue and white objects in our homes. We have connections to them, and that's true for many of the artists in this exhibition. There are over 30 artists featured, and they come from around the world, from the United States and Europe, from Asia, from the Islamic world, and from Latin America. And this really is due to the fact that blue and white has touched all of those parts of the world. Each of those countries has its own tradition that connects to blue and white. All of the works in the exhibition were made within the last 15 years. This is a very contemporary project. However, all of those pieces do connect to larger traditions of blue and white, and so we encourage you to get out into the museum and make those connections between the past and the present. Japanese artist Nakashima Harumi looks at blue and white through the lens of abstraction, departing from the blue and white traditions of his home country and instead thinking about the ways that blue and white, that sort of contrast between the deep cobalt and the bright white can be used to make an abstract statement. British artist Robert Dawson uses digital technology to transform tradition, specifically the willow pattern. Artist Justine Hackenberg looks to the still life, a venue in which blue and white objects are often found, in order to transform and to rethink how blue and white functions in our worlds. Fashion design team Rodarte looks to blue and white as a way to speak about memory. We're very excited to have this object, the dress and shoes by Rodarte, the shoes manufactured by Nicholas Kirkwood, as a new part of the MFA's collection. There will be a diverse array of types of work on view in the exhibition, everything from discrete objects to large-scale installation. We will be having some of the artists come in to install their work specifically for the show. And beyond those installations, the exhibition will feature a number of objects that have never before been seen in a museum setting. Make sure to see the exhibition New Blue and White on your next visit and to explore blue and white all through the galleries.